We help organizations build capability in artificial intelligence. That involves three different parts. So in general, you need expertise, technology, and people. Lone wolf terrorism is on the rise. Like for me personally, I was in Boston when the marathon bombings were happening, and I was in London with the spate of recent attacks here. And it's really hard for conventional intelligence agencies because one person being radicalized in their bedroom doesn't show up under conventional surveillance techniques. In collaboration with the Home Office, we've built an artificial intelligence algorithm, essentially a sophisticated computer program, that can spot particular types of extremist propaganda. So the model we built is designed to capture Daesh propaganda so that it can be removed from the internet. And, uh, and here's how it works. So we have two videos here on the screen. One of them is a Daesh propaganda video. The other is perfectly innocent news coverage of Daesh. And at first glance, they're reasonably indistinguishable, but the model is capturing subtle signals that both videos are throwing off, which allow it to distinguish the Daesh propaganda video from basically every other video on the internet. So we can see here that this video is fairly low risk and it's flowing along in the background. This is just a bit of news reporting, but this video over here is sending off some very scary looking signals. It's a Daesh propaganda video and the model's been designed so that it can capture videos like this as they're uploaded, so they should never make it onto the internet in the first place. The expertise we've built up over you know, 200, 250 different data science projects across a whole range of industries. There's probably no vertical that we haven't worked in. The technology, we've built a platform called ShellCanal, which is the world's best platform for deploying data science models. In terms of people, we run this program called the ASI Fellowship, which about five to 10% of all the UK science and maths PhDs apply to. Only 10% of those get selected. And so there's some incredibly smart people that go on to work with the companies in and around our network. We believe artificial intelligence is the sort of transformative technology of our time. The value of artificial intelligence is going to be when it can be used by governments, when it can be used by companies, by hospitals, by schools. We're really focused in bringing this technology to the real world.